This is Joe Rosanel with the front line. And once again, let us go into the breach. The University of Notre Dame campus bookstore is making LGBT ideology and astrology practices available by selling gay children's books and tarot cards. Recently, the Irish Rover, the campus newspaper, published an article detailing various products available in the school's store, including content for children. Notre Dame recently signed a contract with Barnes & Noble, switching their bookstore services from Follett Company, the article began. This change has brought with it several decks of tarot cards and increased promotion of ast astrology and numerous sexualized children's books. This is a shame because the University of Notre Dame is a fantastic university. This doesn't mean the whole university is bad. But what it does mean is the bishop should speak up. And even if he did speak up, sadly, the politics in the church right now wouldn't basically nothing would come of it. Sadly, he should speak up, though, if he knows if he knows about it. What should happen, though, is the trustees, the donors of the university have to speak up. And frankly, if behavior like this continues, they should hold back money. Money moves the dial, even in the church. This is how we have to have our voices known. When you see bad behavior, stop funding it. I will not go to a parish that doesn't do the right thing, i.e. speak the truth in its fullness. I will not give them a cent. I will not give orders a cent if they are not fully and fully living and practicing and speaking the Catholic faith. And that goes for universities. We're here to live the truth speak the truth, and suffer for the truth. That's what we're called to do as Catholics. And that means our universities have to be truly Catholic. And this type of behavior, frankly, shouldn't exist at a school, a wonderful school like Notre Dame. Because again, it's not the whole school. I'm not condemning Notre Dame, but it's people who give them money, the alumni. They have to speak up. And frankly, if this behavior continues, they should stop funding the university. And I get and guess what? If that happens, I bet you this type of behavior ceases.